you are welcome to my channel. If you are new kindly subscribe and press the notification button for onward information. Thank you. Mr. Shalom here commends the beneficiaries for their patience and mentioned that as a leader in the community, by God's grace there is no cause for alarm as we are closer to disbursement than ever. Pay attention to this. Today, I want to say one or two things on the state of things uh, in, the, in the grant community <clears throat> as it concerns UAAG expected disbursement. First and foremost, I want to say uh, season greetings to all Nigerians, you know, to the non-Muslims, I'm sorry, to, to the, to the non-Christians, I say season's greetings, and to the Christians, I say Merry, Merry Christmas in areas and Happy New Year in advance. By God's grace, we will uh, see the New Year safely and enjoy. By God's grace, the New Year will give us what we expect to the glory of God. Fine. Concerning the expected disbursement of UAAG grant, as a leader in the community and uh, also a leader, you know, in the system, I want to tell you Nigerians that. Uh, by God's grace, there is no cause for alarm. By God's grace, there is no cause for alarm. We are closer to disbursement than ever. A leader even wrote that uh, disbursement has begun indirectly from the way, you know, that they look at things. They say, oh, forget it, don't start. So, so it depends on how close you are. To what you are seeing but i come to tell you that we are closer to disbursement than ever and if you say it has started it's not far from truth in the sense that our god told us last week he said the schedule for payments have been taken to cbn the schedule for payments have been taken to you know to cbn that means apostle ken wakama and the UAG management have done all they need to do. They have handed it over to uh, CBN. So that's why we can say it is as good as done. If you are working in a company, it is time to be paid. And your ogre tell you that your schedule for payment has been taken to the bank. What remains? It means the hand of your guy. It's no longer in the matter. The matter is not in the hands of the bank. So let us be patient and wait for CBN to finish their work. And by my findings, as we speak, CBN is on holiday now. I make my findings and I confirm that CBN is on holiday now. So where they where the work reached before they went on holiday, right? They need to to come back before they can continue. However, you know, sometimes, you know, the, some uh, steps can be taken to fast track something. I can assure you that as we speak, as I'm making this VN, Apostolic is still trying his best to see that even though CBN is on holiday, to still see what can be done even now to help us get the money this year. It's working. It's working. I can assure you that. All right. So, if God help him, he can still get something before this year runs out. But in case you know it's not easy for him, then we have an option that wait till next week or next month or next year. Don't forget the next year, the next month is what is next week. Oh. All right, it's next week. So, but I'm assuring you that work is going on underground to ensure that certain things be done even now before this year runs out. But in case the efforts do not prove productive, then we have to wait till we enter the new year, which we are entering by Monday, 
by God's grace. That's what I can say. That's what I can tell us about the state of UG disbursement. I'm not a member of top management. I'm just a small boy in UAG. But in my little position, I'm telling you authentic information that's available to me. So let us be patient. The issue is not whether money day or whether whether money no day. It has passed that level. The, the issue is for CBN to, to finish their work on the schedule and start to credit the account. So people said, ah, we had that uh, CBN accredited uh, 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 commercial banks, this and that. What are you saying again? Did you hear it officially from UG management that CBN accredited the uh, commercial banks? I'm telling you official information, which all of us had from the CD. He said, schedule for payment are to CBN. So, it's waiting for CBN to do their work, then commence uh, disbursement. When you hear two uh, contradicting information, you weigh the two. Which one is more authentic than, than, than the other? I'm working on what August said. Thank you, the schedule priest, for this very message of yours. Uh, this is a clear message to all the NGOs no, that are warming up to siphon this I learned that, uh, some people UAAG are warming up for grants. Uh, that it will, not, that it will never be easy for the NGOs planning to, to go away with this money meant for the masses. You don't protest. When I keep saying that I have a proof of some to. NGOs that are collecting money so been, much as we speak as right now company, in this grant community they are saying that they will be paying to some order, NGO, some NGO will not receive you their money and, address them, and this is really my an issue workers. you contribute to them to uh, travel to invest and all that at the end your, of the day look at what they are bank. doing once the bank is true you will start to, to get to have, you are last. The management of UAAG suggests that the they disburse this money for one or two reasons, themselves, one not to give to the NGO direct to disburse to the masses. What belongs to the NGO should go to the NGO. What belongs to the masses should go to the masses. Because their plans is never for good for the masses. Thank you. So you this is you should know my piece of course, information to I'm not again protesting. the management of the UAAG grant. Many of you know. Go to your life of the, your preferred channel. If you go back to my VNC, grant you know issues, consider to subscribe when and I turn on the bell for notification out, whenever I, we drop I, information I, 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 regarding the disbursement of this very I'm grant. Then, A big two, thank you to the UAAG management, a big thank you to Apostle Ken Wakama. Thank you to all Grand Pressure Group for their A4 making sure that this money gets to the masses. They always stand with the masses and we celebrate them for their good work towards the disbursement of UAAG grants. Masses. I, I be rest assured I should defend the management if they are right i will tell you that you aag grant but if they are not right certain. i have the way of advising them and everything has been done disbursement will kick off so but for now very soon for anybody to think of protest now this is life of the report just, just thank you for you stopping by you have to protest now my question is against whom are you protesting is, is it against against a post came or against uag the people that have prepared the schedule for payment and sent to CBN. Okay, now, now that uh, the CBN are yet to finish their work, are you not going to protest against CBN? That why, why have they not finished their work? So we have to think twice before we do things. I know some people are hungry to protest against Apostolic and against UEG. They are hungry. They are hungry inside them. 
I don't want to satisfy that hunger. My advice is, Yoruba says, Taban Sukun Amari Ron. When we are crying, we do see. You don't cry and close your eyes. You open your eyes. Because something is making you to cry. So you have to open your eyes so that if another thing is coming, you will see and dodge. But many people are crying with their eyes closed. And they, they, are, they are shouting protest. I don't know why. Against whom do you want to protest? Against Aposken and UAG or against CBN? Tell me. So I will advise that we calm down. We calm down. There's no amount of your protest that can make that can change things with the way things are. If I do come out now to tell you that Aposken is trying his best to ensure that the money is still you won't know. But the guy is there, not sleeping, working day and night. Because of you, because of me. And some still gather themselves because they collect one error from some from somewhere. I said it before. Any protest now is a sponsored protest. I you know, huh? I'm saying it with a, you know with both mouths. Any protest now is a sponsored protest. It's not realistic. My advice to all these Nigerians, calm down, calm down, calm down. We are almost there. We are almost there. Many people know that banks will not jump a step when they are processing even loan. They won't, they won't, they won't jump a step. They will follow each step. Banks won't, won't they jump a step when they are, they are doing their work. They follow each step you know, as needed. So the only thing that can be done is to plead with them. Please, you know, this, this is holiday. Can you help us fast track? You know, it's pleading. At this stage, you should know that CBN is you no know, is boss to UAG. And how do you do you approach your boss? Do you appear before your boss and command him? You must, you must approach your boss with humility. So let us get our senses clear, please, and understand the situation of things. Schedule have been taken to CBN, so said the CD of UAG. And that's the truth. So let us calm down for CBN to finish their work and uh, disburse the money. Our life that applied for the money, it is the same life that will get the money. Yet 2004 is just next week. Next year, next month is just next week. Let us calm down. I trust my boss. If God help him, we can still hear something before this year runs out. If God help him. But in case, you no, know, it, it, it is God's will that he should no, no, next week is by the corner. All right. So when we enter next week, when we enter new year, and CBN resumes, go and find out how CBN operates before you start to agitate. Go and find out how CBN operates at the end of the year, stroke the new year. God will help us. God will bless us. UAG development is a done deal by God's grace. The food is ready. And nothing can stop it. Since that switch, the Apex Bank, you rest assured, the money is coming. And God bless us all. I am your friend and brother, Akim Shola Josiah, aka Mr. Shalom. Until I see the need to come your way again, I wish you happy and prosperous. New Year. Thank you so much.